moves off the whole side of the highway to pull this out. Yeah, I'm starting to get sick of this cold though. And this cold inside, which is getting a little too bad. I think I'm gonna head home now. It kinda sucks, but we'll be back. We'll be back on the mission soon. Seeing all them sights that have to be seen. It became so snowy last night, you could actually see it on the floor. But I had to pull into this little truck stop area. Started my day at the far end of Virginia over here in Bristol, where I started. Didn't see any of it, but it, that's why it really hurts me, you know, to skip all these towns and not know anything what they're about. Gotta go all the way back up through Pennsylvania and into New York. The train! It's been a while. It's been a while. Yeah, that's right. It's been a while since I've seen a train. Oh, yeah. Hit me with those dulcet tones, baby. Oh, yeah. Interestingly enough, this place doesn't belong to any county. It's its own independent city. And of the 41 independent cities, 38 of them belong to Virginia. Don't quite know why, but I know they'll never go thirsty, these guys over here. On top of the snow. These guys might be a little chilly, but they'll never be thirsty. This guy right here. On the other side, there's some gigantic flower pots. Some more flowers. This bridge was made in 1959, but what is this guy doing stepping on somebody? It's like he's trying to beat the other guy with a chicken foot. You're not throwing my highway today, boy. You and your horseshoes. We drive cars over here. You can see you're not far from any other source of water. Got one there. And it looks like you even got the old coal spout where you used to get all your water to burn the steam. I don't think I've ever seen one of these guys. Just leads to the middle of nowhere, this little bit of track. There's even some Jack Link down here. Sasquatch been over here? Bigfoot? I saw his hoax yesterday, but... Oh yeah! Oh, it looks like half a payphone. That one has definitely seen better days. I wonder what diseases it has, though. Yeah, I accept the charges. A big toothbrush is over here. <laughs> and you see the signs, actually, a big thing of floss. Big boils over here, too. One of the Staunton Public Library. It's a metal book. And a car I'm about to be run over by. <laughs> Wonder if that could have been my lover. Because Virginia is for lovers. You know, most people theorize that maybe even Bigfoot met his love in Virginia. Don't know if that's true, but hey. I didn't know you could do such cool things with metal until I got out into the world and saw all the chickens and other craziness. There don't seem to be many words on these books, but uh... Guess they're enticing us to make our own. Use our imagination. Am I putting too much into this? It's your book. It's your life. It's nothing. You gotta write your own story. Don't follow a predetermined one. Unless you believe that... Uh, free will doesn't exist, then I guess you believe that your story's already written. But, uh, hey. I like to believe in free will. Gavinger hunt continues with this gigantic metal fire hat. I wonder if I could become a fireman for a day in here. Think so? Think they would allow me to? Oh, that's really cool. Got the old stuff. Old fire engine over there. If you can see it. It's awesome. They also got smaller creatures here. They got a soldier of some sort and a giraffe. And a bunch of, oh, oh, look at that pineapple. It's bringing back the old pineapple pack days. It's bananas. Maybe I could wear that fire, fire department uniform for my one day. Looks like they have a bunch of antique train cars over there. Old cabooses. Never know what you'll find 
in these old small towns. I had no clue. But that's the Freight Depot loading platform, circa 1894. The Depot Grill. Where they used to hold any manner of stuff. Look at the inside of that guy. Actually got a train car as some sort of steak place. With fabrics and other buildings. Over here. It's an active Amtrak track. Well, that's the way it would have looked. Looks like this would have been the uh, the freight house that we were just at. Even earlier than that. Even get on top of it up here. Nice little overwalk. Get a bird's eye of those train cars now. The train track. That would have had to refill right by that guy. I think that used to be it. Water refill station, or maybe even coal. A hell of a sight from up here. And you could know what all these things are. But the corresponding numbers. 13, you see Augusta Courthouse right there. That woman on top. Funny that even though it doesn't belong to a county, it still has the county courthouse. For some reason, when I get going and I get vlogging and stuff, only when I stop do I feel sick and I, I can really feel it. But if I'm going, I'm going. We're only gonna have to give it one of the cooler small towns I've seen. Gonna have to try and make some more miles and see a doctor. Good looking courthouse for sure. Hey, look at all Mount Jackson over here. Got the apple barrel water tower. That's what I'm talking about. Marilyn, what up? Been a long day, but I finally made it to Pennsylvania. Be careful, don't hydroplane. I don't think it'd be better to be on a plane. They ain't going no way. That got you for three hours. Wonder if all those trucks know what they're missing. Never underestimate the power of a small city. That place was awesome. I'll see you tomorrow.